Minus Flat. We're here to post another move. Today's move, we have a push up. So we're gonna start nice and simple. We're gonna show what the move is and then we'll kind of break it down. So with a push up, the goal is to be up on the toes and my hands and I'm lowering myself to the ground and then I'm pushing myself back up. Coming down, pushing back up. With the push up, there's a lot of different ways to either advance that move or to modify it. Starting with the modifications, our first one would be to want to walk our hands out. We're still coming down, back up. What we don't want is to get those hands too close so that I'm not really pushing myself up. So challenge those hands, we're coming down, and we're coming back up. So I can still feel most of that weight up on the chest, not back up on my hips. Another way to modify that move is to come all the way down, take that little rest, and then really get a good push. So I'm coming down, I'm resting, and I'm pushing back up. I like that modification more than sometimes you'll see here and we're here. You've got to remember that the move is called a push up. So when I'm coming down a couple inches, I'm only getting a two inch push. I would rather see people come all the way down and get, you know, eight to 12 inches of push, back down the rest, and then a push. The big thing with a push up is you got to kind of figure out why are you doing the push up. It's a great way to boost the metabolism. For me, it's a good three o'clock move because that energy is coming down. How do I kind of energize myself? Do I eat a 200 calorie snack or do I bust out a couple push ups and boost that metabolism? So it's a great move that we can just come down. We get a couple seconds of push ups. I'm not affecting my legs, but at the same time, I'm boosting my metabolism. We want two things. I don't want my hands to be too forward or too forward or too back. I also don't want them to be too narrow or too wide. So I want to find that perfect position that works for me. When we come from in to out, we have to think about as my hands are wide, I'm going to really be able to open up that chest. When they come in, I'm going to be working that tricep a little bit more. So it kind of goes back to why do I want to do a push up? Am I looking to work my chest? Am I working to do my triceps or can I do a little bit of both? So when we come, here would be more of a tricep push up. You can really see an extension from that arm. And then here would be opening up that chest, stretching out those back muscles more. Both have really good benefits. Both are worth giving them a try.